So today I have the Castle Arts 48 color pencils, the pastel set. And this box looks so nice. The box is really, really amazing. I, I'm really astonished. I like it a lot. And let's see what we have inside. So again, we have some uh, brochures from Castle Art. I think they are all the same as the other ones that I tried. This should be the swatch, I think. And yes, this is the big swatch. There you can see what colors they have, what they offer. And this is the pastel selection. So you actually do not get these pastel colors in the other sets. Then we have create a pastel pencil illustration. Again, I, I think this is really nice what the castle art is doing. They offer like small instructions what you can do. And this is also nice which colors to use. So yeah, really, really, really nice. Um, the set of uh, the list of the colors, you have them here. There is a small sheet for um, the swatch <laughs> and again we have the pastel tint pencils what is this taking your art to the next level there are also some instructions how to draw something um, how to blend also really really nice there are some examples here again and now we are coming to the pencils oh my god Look how nice these colors look like. And you get these, these small handles to lift this up. And underneath there is the second part, second tray, which you can also take out, which I find nice. And let's take a look at the pencils. Okay. So let's take this one out. So these ones are different than the rest of the castle arts because the original ones have the black barrel and the gold ones have blue bar barrel and these ones actually have like you see it's a colored barrel and i like this a lot and also they have here like a silver line and it's actually engraved so it's not just the line outside it is it goes uh, like a little bit inside i also find that really nice so we have, I hope you can see this, um, there is a color name, a color number, castle arts, and oh, they also write from which collection that is, the pastel tint. Yeah, they look amazing. So let's watch them and see how they perform.
So these Castle Arts pastels, pastel colored pencils were the softest ones from the from all the Castle Art that I tried. And I okay, you can see here the colors. The colors are really nice. They are really this is definitely 100% a pastel set. I did a, a, a test and I wanted to see how the pencils feel. I tried to find similar colors. So here we have this blue one and this is the pastel set and this is the gold set. I did not find it in the 72 set of the original ones which I have. Here we have again pastel set, gold and the original set. I will zoom in a little bit. And here again the same thing. Um, so the pastel set is, as I said, really soft. These are like smooth and soft and they are not scratchy at all. Um, the moment you use the gold ones, these ones, you can feel the difference. These are drier and mm, harder, maybe a little bit harder. In this case, I was then using also the original ones and there is a little bit difference also between two, these two ones. I would actually say that maybe even the gold ones are maybe a little bit harder. No, no, not so much, but they are almost the same. But the difference is the feel because these ones, the gold ones are more, they feel like um, not the pastel sticks, how to say that. Yes, they feel more chalky, like when you use those, that chalk, chalk on the board. So yes, they feel a little bit more drier like that. For my personal taste, I like the originals the, the most. I have the feeling that with the original ones, I can layer more. With the gold ones, I cannot get so many layers. And with the pastel ones, uh, really soon I come to the place where um, the pencil is slipping off the paper. So these are really soft, but that's why you can also not layer them so much. Then these ones, you can still layer them. They are harder and uh, let's say it like this. They are not hard colored pencils. They are harder in comparison to the pastel set. I hope that is clear because I love Castle Arts colored pencils. I'm just saying that for my taste, I would stick to the original ones because I, when I also was doing the test, when I was te testing the gold set, I did not notice, notice a difference, a big difference between those two, except for the white colored pencil. And I don't think it pays off to buy this set and pay 20 euros or <laughs> even 40 euros more just to get the white colored pencil then go out and buy your Derwent drawing white just to say it like that so I would really stick to the original set and then if you want to have pastel colors I would buy these ones because they are not included in these two sets the same thing all happened also here uh, again for my taste, I like how the paper is covered with the uh, original ones. The gold ones are also okay, but I like it. The original ones give you more even coverage. That's, that, that's it. That is the word. They, you get to e more even coverage. But the, past, the pastel colors are really nice. So I'm not if they are they would be a good extension to to the sets so i have here the castle arts pastel set i have the aerogitan also pastel set here and also on this paper i have the chorus pastel set so let me see so that we can see all of them i think this is okay so if you Take a look at the Irogitan pastel set, for example, these two colors look, um, I would say, almost the same. Um, then these two ones, uh, do we have any more? 
the blue well they are similar they are quite similar these two and these really bright ones are not in this set so they are not here um yeah so the irogitan pastel set has more uh, brighter colors like even more than these ones but i do not like the irogitan colored pencils because for my taste they are too hard and they are just not for me so i would definitely not buy these ones again um we have here down the chorus um pastel set you get like more or less the same colors in this 24 set of course this is this is the 48 so you get much more but i mean this uh 24 set is i think completely in this set so if you buy this one you do not need uh for example chorus set i watch then would be even brighter but i really as i said i do not like them because they are too hard for my taste and now i have here the brute funer 80 pastel set and let's just take a look out at these two so now when i look at these two um sets you get most of the colors in this set are also here and then you get here additional colors so maybe you do not have in this brutfunner set there for example this one this color is not here uh, and these three these three are not included the rest more or less they are here for example in this set brutfunner has really nice this um, i would call all of them these skin color sets really pale and then you have other colors which you also have in this set maybe a tick stronger the ones from brute funer this one is also here yeah when i look at them they are like really similar colors as i said brute funer also has some additional colors like these ones i can really live without these ones i do not need them they are just too too vibrant too neon color for my taste um but again considering the price i would go for this one this is a real pastel set and this one you get something some more colors and some different colors but still you get the majority of the colors that are in the castle arts pastel set so let's try and just color just just one or two flower petals i'm gonna take let's let's just see how they work it's not the brightest one do we have any stronger yellow in this set So this was the Brute Furner 80 set and this is the Castle Arts 48 set. I did not want to finish it, but still you can see that there is not a lot of difference between these two ones. Um, the way how the pencils cover the paper is uh, almost the same. It's really, they are so similar. The only ones where I'm like more impressed with the blending and coverage of the paper were the ones uh, from black widow so this is one because i really liked this transition it looks so smooth whereas this one is i mean these transitions are also nice but you can still see some um parts where the color was mixed or over overlapped this one is like this transition is really really nice But the Black Widow pastel set is a more, uh, where is it? I actually have it here. Just give me a second. 
yes here it is so this is the black widow pastel set so i would actually say that this is just like a half pastel set because you get these colors here but these are more like normal colors which you would get in other sets so that's why i this is i would say maybe 20 set pastel colors So if you also want to see the comparison of the Castle Arts colors and the Black Widow set. So here you have it. For example, the ones that are, that are not in the Brute Funner 180 um, 80 set, they are actually in this Black Widow set. Oops, I just lost a pencil. So the ones that were not in the Brute Funner 80 set are actually in this Black Widow set, as you can see here. And then we have these other colors, but once again, the Black Widow, I would consider it a pastel set maybe until here, somewhere. This included, these, these ones, except for this one, are more like normal colors. Also these ones, you, you get them everywhere in every set. But then again, when you buy a set like this, it is nice to have a stronger color also. My problem with the Black Widow was that I had to press really hard uh, to get the pigment out. And that was my biggest issue with these ones, because over time you would have some yeah, hand pain. You would get, you would get some pain in the hand. Uh, for these ones, I also had to press a little bit stronger. I think the Brute Funer would be the ones where I had to press the least to get the pigment out on the paper. But they are harder than Castle Arts. And once again, the Irogiten, if you want to see them here, my not my taste, not my colored pencils. Um, the chorus are fine even though these ones were nice if you get them for a couple of bucks that's still a nice price and they are a nice set so this pastel art uh, pastel set is actually different from the other pastel from the other castle arts uh, colored pencils because it is much softer so these colored pencils are definitely much softer than the rest of the castle arts Okay, so that would be it for these pastel colors. Thank you for watching. I hope you now have some overview of these pastel sets and can decide for yourself what you want to have and which one you like the most. So thank you for watching and see you next time. Bye!